Well, what started off as a simple Facebook post may have changed the course of one man's life, uniting him with a piece of his heart that he never knew was missing. Rashawn Haynes has the story that you'll only see here on 25 News. Glenn Bowie just returned to the River City to promote his book, The Art of Speaking into Existence. The book is his life story. About three years ago, when the book first came out, Bowie promoted it on social media, looking to build traction. But little did he know, an entire chapter was missing. Sherry Lamy, a counselor at Richwoods High School, was shown this post advertising Bowie's book. I looked at it and I just, I couldn't believe the resemblance that I saw to one of my sons. Intrigued by what she saw, Lamy went to Bowie's Facebook to find out more. There, she came across some congratulatory comments about the book from family members. Names she remembers seeing on Ancestry.com. I really got nervous and surprised and shocked wow. that this might be my dad. Lemmy spent most of her life not knowing much about her father, other than the fact he and her mother dated before he moved away to pursue baseball in Arizona and eventually landing in California. But after a little investigating of her own, Sherry took a leap of faith and reached out to him. Yeah, I just kind of introduced myself and told him I have something kind of crazy to tell you, and I don't know how to say this, but I think you might be my father. Bowie was skeptical at first. I thought maybe it was random. I thought maybe someone had sent a message to, to maybe the wrong person. But he says he always wanted children, so he kept an open mind. I was really excited to to find out what was going on, but I was also kind of nervous a little bit. The speculations were later confirmed through DNA testing. Three years and hundreds of memories later, the two were like best friends enjoying their new extended family. Bowie was introduced to his grandkids who bring him an unimaginable joy. And Lamy got to meet her 91-year-old grandmother before she died. Bowie believes their meeting allowed his mother to leave this earth peacefully, knowing that they had each other. They're both beyond grateful for the connection. I mean, the timing of it couldn't have been better. Yes. 